Hey, what up, y'all? The view is just better from up here, right? <laughs> Yo, about to clock in to work in the bed, but I'm trying to get my grub on, you know what I mean? This is a uh, Whole Foods um, chicken, um, a ciabatta bread, goat cheese sandwich. <laughs> it's re really fire. And the shorty that made this is really fire. <laughs> know what I mean? Mm. But, uh, you know, mm. give me a second. So, yeah, I was seeing a TikTok about this dude. He was saying that he had like meetings with this company. I don't know if he's famous or he's like a big streamer or whatever, but it was like, give me one second. Mama said it's rude to talk with <laughs> with your mouth full. This one TikTok dude said that companies are paying streamers hella money, paying hella people hella money just to record their lives, just to record their content. And this is the day and age that we live in. And I believe that dude, you know, these these influencers, IG, all these people, TikTok, whatever, YouTubers, they're making a hella bank, like just going with the flow, just doing what they're doing in their daily lives. And it's crazy that we live in a day and age where people want to see what you're doing. And, uh, you know, it's really, you know, it's trippy, you know? Um, kind of like stalker status you know what i mean like tmz like oh did you see uh you know um you know kanye coming out of uh such and such restaurant and people like will gravitate towards that like oh my god kanye uh it's, it's crazy celebrities relationships things like that um i guess what i'm trying to get at is um you know don't be don't be scared like you know i i me i was an introvert I, I guess I am an introvert. I don't really, you know, I like to my own, you know, I like to have my own privacy. You know, I, my parents didn't raise me off of no internet. And, you know, I, I, can't, I grew up in a, you know, both, both halves. You know, I grew up without it and I grew up with it. But uh, what I'm trying to get at is, you know, just upload. Like, you know, we live in a day and age, you can make money easy. Like, you know, you can make money at your job, but you could also do YouTube or you also could do whatever you want. And, you know, I know people right now that are selling clothes on Etsy and making bank and, you know, it's a different age, man. It's like, you know, we got a staff shortage right now in this world. You know, you know, I know there's like, you know, you know, vaccine mandates and all that, but it's because it's not, I don't think it's because of that, but it's because we live in a new age, like where people don't want to work for the man. They want to work for themselves, you know, and you can work for yourself. Just keep streaming, keep doing whatever you want to do, you know? the dream is there you don't want to be on your deathbed and be like oh i should have done that i should have done this you know today is the day but keep moving forward and keep doing your thing you know the get sit vlog remember all about getting it you know i got an interview with, with school tomorrow see how that goes you know what i mean you know if you want to do the school route that's cool you know what i mean you know the the school route will help you in the future help get your money up I me mean, i do my rapping thing i make money off of that too you know it ain't much but it's cool man it's cool just to live your dream i'm already making it man i don't need a million dollars i don't need 10 shorties i don't need 10 whips i'm already making it man i got my nice car here you know of course i'm gonna level up and get me something nicer but in the meantime while i'm while i'm here and i'm doing my thing you know I'm just going with the flow and I'm stacking and I'm, I'm keeping my head right. I'm keeping that positivity. You know what I mean? Is it a crime that I still want it? Big bucks, big trucks. I got big dreams on this rocky road. No ice cream. Satan trying to get the victory. But I got my vest and God is here with me. <laughs> oh, man. That's some unreleased from around coming soon. But, uh, yeah, y'all, just keep doing your thing. Keep positive. Um, don't want to make this too long because I'm going to finish eating what I, you know, what I paid for, you know, my nice sandwich. 
you know but uh yeah y'all I'll, I'll keep uh y'all updated this is day uh day nine of retention and your boy got the glow you know the woman attraction is there um i'm gonna speak on that before before i dip uh yeah i got woman attraction you know my energy just feels good you know for people that that think you know sr c retention is a placebo like i'm sorry to tell y'all like you know you just haven't tried it yet like you know the first week is really rocky and if you make it through the first week you know you got that power you know you start to see the glow like my confidence is up you know if i bust or i relapse or you know i'm watching the website like my head's down like i have no confidence like i got that fog you know the foggery <laughs> you know that brain fog you know you don't like that and i also went to whole foods too to give me some turmeric shots and ginger shots all that stuff will will help clear you out so the first week is a pretty much a detox you know once you once you change yourself and and you're ready for that sr journey you know that first week is a detox and the first month is a real real challenge that you got to go after and you have to really stay dedicated and keep yourself busy uh, because if you're not you're gonna go back to old routines old habits you know going on a website me i don't want to i don't want to do that because i know all the work i i've done every day is as, as a work day for me and i'm working on myself but uh yeah woman attractions there i got a mother of three like she's like on me i'm like you know i don't know man like you know there's a lot of girls that i'm meeting these days and they have kids you know i'm getting older like you know <laughs> i don't really i don't see myself in that situation nothing against you like if you want to date a girl with a chick with a kid you want to date a chick with a kid that's cool but me uh, i don't i don't think so man I, i'm not ready because i would like to have my own my own girl and my own kid and you know start my family you know it might just be like a you know a little situation shit but i'm also running into other girls too um I, I just don't have time for it right now if it happens it happens you know you know we do the thing but for the meantime i'm, I'm focused on me and I'm focused on like what I got to do in this life and you know I'm really like you know I'm 27 a couple more years to 30 and you know and by the time I'm 30 I want to be chilling like I want to be like you know having money and, and being good and you know I don't have to worry about nothing like all females will come to me you know money will come to me you know I already work hard my my whole 20 my my whole 20s is about working hard my 30s is going to be about chilling so so fellas if you if you're watching this and you're younger than than me it's all good. You don't have to have things figured out. But uh, just keep going with the flow day to day. Whatever you want to do in this life, you can do it. You know what I mean? Uh, to the next Gets It vlog, I'm your host with the most, Romero Gets It. You know, add me on all the medias and all that good stuff. And yeah, y'all.